This video is of a home theater that I built in my basement. This is a low cost, a low budget uh, home theater, so there's not a lot of frills to it. But anyway, I ended up buying an Optima HD 33 uh, projector and then uh, ceiling uh, mounted it. Um, the room is about uh, 22 feet long by 14 foot wide, and I have about 9 foot 2 high ceilings down here in the basement. Um, I painted the that whole back wall white and, and marked off where my projector size was with that to make it a little bit easier. And then I painted the rest of the wall black uh, and I built bookcases around that. I'll turn on some lights so you can see the bookcases. I used a bare ultra white uh, for the screen uh, where I painted where the screen area was and the rest was just a flat black. So anyway, here's uh, how it looks like with the lights on. The overhead uh, lights wash out the screen. Uh, they're a little bit too bright for it. But anyway, uh, I'll show you how I built the, uh, the bookcase around it. Uh, the lower bookcase is, uh, these are just a couple 1x10s uh, there. And then I got the Bose uh, cube uh, speaker system, one in the middle and one on each side, and then a couple in the back. Uh, but anyway, again, this was, these were just 1x10s uh, here. And then the back's just painted black. Uh, and then similar with the with the uh, side uh, bookcase for the uh, CDs, that was their, that's a, just a one by six uh, for that. So that was uh, simple enough to do that. So anyway, that's uh, my system uh, that I have. This is uh, right now playing is just a streaming uh, YouTube video from uh, it's Jackson Hole uh, Town Square from Jackson Hole, Wyoming. But anyway, it's kind of fun to watch as a continuous live stream. So. Uh, Kind of fun to see some snow. But anyway, thanks for watching. Bye. Oh, and the screen's a 160 inch diagonal. Bye.